Hello my dear children, welcome to EVS class. In today's EVS class, we will start a new chapter, chapter number 14, Plants Around Us. Children, when we go to a park, we see a lot of greenery around the garden, right? This greenery around us are called plants. Do you know children, plants are our green friends. They are all around us. They keep the air fresh and clean. They make the surroundings look beautiful and make us feel better. They also give us different food items such as fruits and vegetables. Plants are of different shapes and sizes. Some plants are tall and big. Some are short and small, and some are very small. Together, they make the plant kingdom. Just like us, plants also grow and need air to breathe. We are interdependent on each other, which means we cannot live without plants, nor do the plants can live without us. We give carbon dioxide to plants, and plants gives us oxygen to breathe. Therefore, we need plants to live and plants need us to grow. So children, in today's EVS class, we will learn what are the different parts of a plant, what do plants need to grow, and how do the plants grow. Now children, let's learn about different parts of a plant. Like us, Plants also have different body parts. Each part has its own function. Look at a picture. A plant is divided into two main parts. They are the root system and the shoot system. Root system. The bottom parts that is below the soil are the root system. Look here children. These are the roots. They grow below the soil. Roots help the plant to stand firmly to the ground. It also helps to absorb water and nutrients from the soil to the plant. Shoot system. The parts which is above the soil are the shoot system. In the shoot system, we have stem, leaf, branch, flower and fruit. Stem. Stem provides support and helps the plant to stand upright. It also carries water and nutrients to different parts of the plant. Leaf Leaf is green in color. Do you know children? Leaves are called the kitchen of the plant. Why? Because it absorbs sunlight from the sun and makes food for the plant. Therefore, it helps the plant to grow healthier. You know, leaves have small openings called stomata, through which plants take in carbon dioxide and give out oxygen. Leaves can be of different shapes and sizes. Branch Branch is a part that grows from the stem. It helps to hold the leaves, flowers and fruits. Flower Flower is the most beautiful part of a plant. The flower produces seeds or fruits. Now let's talk about fruit. Fruit is the most tasty part of a plant. Many flowers grow into yummy fruits which we eat. It has seeds inside. Some fruits have one seed, some have two. Some fruits have many seeds that grow into new plant. I'm sure everyone loves to eat fruits, right? Children, we have to eat lots of fruits to keep us healthy. Different fruits have different tastes, colors, shapes, and sizes. So children, what are the different parts of a plant? The different parts of a plant are root, stem, leaf, branch, flower, and fruit. Children, just like our body parts, each part of a plant are equally important and helps to carry out different functions to keep themselves healthy and strong. Alright? 
Now let us learn what do plants need to grow. Plants need four things to grow. Water. Children, just like us, plants need water to live. They absorb the water through the roots and travels through the stem and into the leaves. Sunlight. Plants need sunlight for energy. Soil. Soil means mitti. Soil provides the roots with nutrients which then transports to the rest of the plant. Lastly, air. Plants also need air to breathe. So children, the plants need all these four sources to grow and stay healthy. Next, let us learn how do the plants grow. The plants grow from seeds. First of all, a seed gets planted in the soil. For the growth of the seed, we know that it needs four main sources. Children, what are they? They are water, air, sunlight and soil, right? Without these, the seeds cannot grow into a plant. Once these conditions are fulfilled, the seed begins to grow. The first sign of growth is a tiny root which comes out of the seed. Slowly, the shoot also starts growing upwards above the soil. Soon we see a baby plant grow with tiny leaves. This process of growth of the seed into a plant is called germination. So children, that's how the plant grow. Children, in order to remember different parts of a plant, let's all try to sing parts of a plant song, alright? The roots on a plant grow underground, underground, underground. The roots on a plant grow underground, roots are part of a plant. The stems on a plant hold up to leaves, up to leaves, up to leaves. The stems on a plant hold up to leaves, stems are part of a plant. The leaves on a plant are making food, making food, making food. The leaves on a plant are making food, leaves are part of a plant. The fruits on a plant are sweet and tasty, sweet and tasty, sweet and tasty. The fruits on a plant are sweet and tasty, fruits are part of a plant. The flowers on a plant are growing seeds, growing seeds, growing seeds. The flowers on a plant are growing seeds, seeds are part of a plant. These are parts of a plant. These are parts of a plant. These